we've got the latest originals from Spitfire. And I had first thought that it might be like a, an originals Eric Whitaker choir from some of the um, from some of the things that they were showing. Fifty voices split into sopranos and altos, tenors and basses. We've got ahs, ums, combos. So let's just dive in. So it comes in there, Spitfire player. I'm just going to um, just pull this up and we'll just see where this takes us. For $29, they're just, they're just knocking it out of the park with these because the quality of these are so, it's just epic. Really. So this is the um, the Long Oz. I'm gonna turn that. Yeah, you've got the dynamic. Now let's push the dynamic layer up so it, it can get soft. And this is with the tree mic. And with some of these, I like taking the releases all the way out. I love the soft, that soft dynamic, but then you can punch it. So that's the ahs, and let's go to the ums. So this is the ums. Now those ums are so nice. For $29, this is fabulous. Thanks, Celine, that's so kind. That's so cool. I mean, I love that, I love the texture. Um, okay, so let's just keep going. Let's go to the long episodic combo and we'll start with the tree. Oh, wow, check this out. Yeah, the, the, the thing is, choir is, the human voice is so um, complex. Okay, now I'm gonna, okay, I'm playing too much. So I'm just gonna hold a key. So listen to that. It, there, there's movement and swelling and listen to that.
So they're singing different things. They're, they're having dynamics going on. Now I'm going to bring the dynamic layer down a little bit. See something here. So you just hold it and let it do all of the work. Beautiful. So while we're here, uh, let's just go to the uh, short staccato uh, syllables. Yeah, BF, that, yeah, that's one of the things about spaces is the, the air, air studio is just you know, typically wet. It just is just, it is wet. And I think that's, that's one of the things that, that I guess because it's, it's, it, it just, it just uh, kind of, it, it doesn't let you get that, that punch, uh, I guess, because by the time it gets out there, it's already, you know, kind of, uh... now I'm going to turn the reverb off and let's just listen to the close mic. So this is probably as dry as we can get this. And to me, it sounds like that the, oh, it's the tightness, okay. Now the tightness will actually cut into the sample. So if you have it all the way here, it's, it's cutting the attack portion off. I'm gonna turn that tightness all the way off so we can hear the full sample. Here we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna hit it. You can hear the decay. Yeah, now this is without any, any reverb and close. Now these syllables are, are kind of round robin. So every time you hit a key, they kind of cycle through. And we do have another preset and you can see down here that you can switch those. So you can select the syllable that you want to play. Yeah, and see here again, they've got the tree mic and the reverb and stuff going on. Now I'm going to turn off the reverb and I'm going to turn the tightness off and close mic this. And let's just hear. So let's get to the guys. So there's 12, there's only 12 presets here. Let's uh, go to the Oz. low dynamics. Let's do the ums, the long ums. And let me bring the dynamic down. It was a dark, blustery night. I stood off to the side of the road wondering, how did I get here? And where am I going? And then I remembered, very cool. That's so cool. 
Okay, let's. Uh, <laughs> we're getting we're getting a little crazy here. Yeah, but but listen how nice and rich those voices are. Just so beautiful. So this is the long episodic combo one. So it gets pretty dramatic. It's like a wave. It's like a, a like a vocal wave. You kind of bring it up. And they kind of go back down with it. It's just evolving and moving. Now, I'm going to turn the ethereal mic on, and this is like a process signal. It's got some really wild EQ. Yeah. And then you can bring in some more body with the tree mic and you can crank the reverb up a little bit. Now, let's do this. Let's just run through the syllables and let's do the combo too. Uh, I don't think we did. Just like it's opening up. Just gives motion and movement. And then let's just uh, hit the syllables. Real quick, the short syllables, I'll turn the tightness down. Dynamics are velocity controlled. Okay, so here we go. Let's do this. I'm going to um, I'm going to pull this up uh, inside of Unify, and I've already kind of uh, pre uh, pre unified these. This way that this allows you to layer. I've got. Um, I've got the sopranos and altos here in instrument one, and then I can um, load the guys, the tenors and basses, on another instrument and have them be able to play side by side together. And then with Unify, you can always split, uh, split these. Here we go. Now this is, let me make sure. Let me make sure I meant the right. Yeah. So we've got the tenors and basses. So we've got tenors and basses. The altos kind of stop here at this um, at this say. Now let's play them together. Yeah, Unify is something that I highly recommend. I highly recommend it. Um, It just allows you to do so many different things. 
So now this is what I'm going to do. Okay, so we've got the uh, the sopranos and altos, tenors and basses. So I'm going to um, I'm going to do this. I'm going to layer intimate strings. Let's pull up intimate strings here, and um, let's see what we've got. Ooh, okay. So I'm going to load a unify layer. Ooh, okay. I've got a heart by this one. It's a BPM split uh, cinematic um, with the. up when we open this up um, it's got the intimate strings here but then we've got some other crazy things going on here yeah John just throws in some crazy things let's turn this down and let's do this let's uh, put on <laughs> Let's uh, let's uh, just get rid of this layer here. I'm going to delete this layer, and let's uh, let's put on the long flotando. And uh... so now we've got the long flotando with intimate strings. So this is intimate strings here, and we've got it layered with the voices. I'm going to throw the um, strings into the uh, reverb a little bit. Now let's blend some more. strings layered with voices. Now let's do this. Let's go ahead and load up Intimate Grand Piano. So this is this is why Unify is so powerful is because just just that quick I've got I've got the uh, the voices, the original voices I've got intimate strings, and now I just loaded the um, the intimate grand piano. So this is the um, the intimate grand piano. Yeah. So now let's layer all of these together. Here we go. Let's get a little bit more voices. instances. That's what I love about Unify. It gives you so much, it gives you so much that you can do. Now let's see, I'm going to uh, go ahead and delete this layer and let's load, um, let's load the dreamy piano uh, preset that he's got here. Um, yeah. Now 
Now this is still the um, Spitfire Originals intimate piano, but John just kind of tweaked it up a little bit. I love being able to just just take these sounds a little bit further inside of Unify and I'm just learning more and more about how to do that. Really nice. Let's just try one more layer here and um, I'll be, um, let's just do the soft drama. And the voices just add such a nice warmth and texture. It's so cool. 